Now your first port of call when you load data into Power BI should always be into the data model. Because you can't do anything with multiple tables without actually building a data model. Now I'm going to show you my best practice techniques for building a quality and intuitive data model. First things first is to always double check the relationships that Power BI guesses. Now Power BI looks like it's guessed some relationships here. So how can we investigate what they've actually guessed? There's a couple of different ways. The first way is to, to hover over the relationship line and make sure that the two correct columns line up. In this case they do because the columns are named exactly the same. We've got product ID here and we've got product ID here. Sometimes though it is not the case and you have to be very aware that Power BI can guess relationships wrong. It can guess the relationship wrong between two columns and it can also uh, guess what the wrong type of relationship type. So just for purposes of this example, what I want to do is I want even to delete the relationships that are created and we're going to recreate them. But first of all, we're going to rearrange things in our data model. There's lots of different ways that you can structure this data model. There's lots of different um, uh, format or lots of different locations you can put tables. You can put them anywhere. You've got immense flexibility. What I'm going to recommend though is a, te uh, uh, a technique that I like to use where I like to put all my tables which I'm going to um, filter my data by. I like to put them all at the top like this. These tables up here are what are called lookup tables. And lookup tables are essentially just filtering tables. They filter what are called fact tables. And fact tables are your tables like sales data, transaction data. It's data at its highest level of granularity. Now, if you structure things like this, it makes it easier to imagine what the filters are doing when you have built relationships between your tables. 